Yeah. I'm going to break character and oh. throw on my glasses because um, I've written something. You got one and done with me. So um, that's basically the way it's going to go. And oh. my better half is going to, um, she's going to hold the lyrics for me. Um, the last four years have been kind of a, uh, it shouldn't be a surprise because I think as a people, we've been growing further and further apart. But now, uh, I don't know. We uh, we both sat and watched the inauguration. Uh, oddly enough, we were waiting out a, a, um, a COVID scare. Thankfully, uh, our test came back negative. But we both were a little sick for a while and were scared to scared to death of what was going on. But we're sitting there watching the inauguration, and I remember when Joe Biden got the nomination, he said that uh, we need to get in touch with our better, better angels, which is something that uh, Abraham Lincoln had come up with. So I thought, well, there's a there's a song title right there. We got to write one. And while I was sitting there watching it, while my baby was choked up with emotions, I started typing some lyrics to myself. And within a day, I think I came up with it. It's called Better Angels. It goes a little something like a these. Uh, oh, that looks good right there. Okay. This is my first time playing. Thank you. 
Thank you, Steve. Thank you. Every little piece of green is precious. Whoops. Every single living thing is precious. Did you know the trees can't feel us? They can hear us since the dawn's first light before we arrived. The stories they would tell if we let them survive because they know every little piece of green is precious. Every single drop of rain is precious. Did you know these ones were mountain range? Where we could stand above the sea and gaze. Now behind these high stone walls, secret birds and flowers grow. And when the sun goes down, they recite creation's prose because they know every little piece of green is precious. Now I have these other words. From the deepest ocean floor to the highest mountain top. Each drift of snow that melts circles earth and never stops. All rivers lead to the sea, the nectar of life for all of humanity. Every little piece of green is precious. Every single drop of rain and drop in the rivulets and rivers and lakes that all end up in the ocean are precious. And that's it. Thank you. Hello. Hello. <laughs> I don't know where he did that. Awesome. All right. I, I'm just going to do this one because 
it made sense. The seaweed is always greener in somebody else's lake. You dream about going up there, but that is a big mistake. Just look at the world around you, right here on the ocean floor. Such wonderful things surround you. What more is you looking for? Under the sea. Uh, under the sea. Darling, it's better down where it's wet to take it from me. Up on the shore, they work all day. Out in the sun, they slave away. While we devoting full time to floating under the sea. Clean the ocean. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. Love it. It's due to our mad scientist, James, that I'm uh, coming to you via Ruse Link. And I'm thrilled to be part of Ocean Aid. I'm going to play a song that I think most of you have heard of. It's an old Joni Mitchell song. And it's, uh, it's a song that focuses on appreciating the environment and appreciating what we've got before it's gone. They paved paradise and they put up a parking lot With a pink hotel, a boutique, and a swinging hot spot Don't it always seem to go That you don't know what you got till it's gone They paved paradise, put up a parking lot They paved paradise and they put up a parking lot They took all the trees and they put them in the tree museum then they charge the people a dollar and a half just to see them. Don't it always seem to go that you don't know what you got till it's gone. They take paradise, put up a parking lot. Hey, farmer, farmer, put away the DDT now. Give me spots on my apples, you're killing the birds and the bees. Please, don't it always seem to go that you don't know what you got till it's gone. Take paradise, put up a parking lot. The big paradise, put up a parking lot. Late last night, I heard the screen door slam. And a big yellow taxi took away our old man. Don't it always seem to go that you don't know what you got till it's gone. Take paradise, put up a parking lot. Yeah, you take paradise, put up a parking lot. You take paradise, put up a parking lot. Yeah! Joni Mitchell. This is called bubblegum ice cream. I miss bubblegum ice cream. I miss my banana seed bike. I miss climbing trees all day with you. I miss surfing in the ocean. I miss cartwheels in the sand. I miss saltwater taffy with you. But there's gonna be a day, yeah. It's coming soon, hang on. We're gonna be okay, I know. Do, do, do. I'm missing you, you. I'm missing you. I miss New York City. I even miss the subway. I miss taco trucks in Brooklyn. I miss dressing up in East Village. 
Okay, I don't know if I should be introducing myself, but uh, my name is Yvonne Sotomayor. I'm at Yvonne Poeta NYC on Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube because I have poetry videos. So this is for Oceanade, and I, I dug up some and wrote a new poem. Um, and this one is called My Iowa Life. Uh, this is when we went to Iowa five years ago, and we performed at the Iowa State Fair. And so, My Iowa Life. This is my husband, Ken Ra, playing beautifully behind me. <laughs> I am beautiful blue. I am the greens and browns. I breathe your love as you softly tickle the bottoms of my feet. I feel your charm and the sharp crackle in your voice. Your loud, tall tires whisking the jobs away. Till dim lights and cool beers signal the day's done. Denim and dung smelling fields rest until the morrow. For now, good voices and pork sandwiches rule the friendly, intimate night. Set up in a small, simple room filled with knowing knaves, where rock and roll and country live, where the far right just might, and a friendly smile can melt you where you're awakened with the clearest and cloudiest and overcome with the hush and where endless roads meet to go nowhere down the road of peace. And so I'm a bilingual poet, so I usually say my poetry in English and translate it to Spanish. So hang in there. Soy el bello azul, tengo los verdes y marrones. Respiro tu amor a medida que me haces cosquilla suavemente las plantas de los pies. Siento tu encanto y el fuerte crujido en tu voz, tus fuertes llantas altas, acabando con todos los trabajos, hasta que las luces tenues y cervezas frías señalan que el día está hecho. Tela vaquera y campos oliendo hasta el gol descansan hasta el día siguiente 
Por ahora, buenas voces y sándwiches de cerdo gobiernan la noche, íntima y amigable. Establecida en una pequeña habitación sencilla, lleno de vecinos conocidos, donde el rock and roll y la música vaquera viven, donde el extremo derecho quizás pueda y una sonrisa te puede derretir, donde despiertas en lo más claro y lo más nublado y eres superado con el silencio y donde los caminos sin fin se reúnen para ir a ninguna parte al cruzar un pedazo de la calle. And so that was my Iowa life, uh, my experiences there. Well, we were there, I think, about a week. Um, so this next one, uh, thank you, Ocean. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> thank you, Ocean. Thank you, Stephen, for challenging me, challenging me to write about uh, nature. Um, uh, I guess uh, after my Iowa life, that was really the closest I've ever gotten. So I had to really think. And so I came up with angry mother nature, actually hurt. She's very hurt at, at what we've done. Um, and so it's called Voice of Nature. And this is totally written for the show. And I did it. <laughs> I am earth and all the wildflowers. I am the melting arctic ice floating by. I am the land you ungratefully stomp on. Where is your love for me? Where is your thankfulness? Will you ever miss me when I'm gone? Or as I'm leaving you now? Look how you treat me, patterned indifference. I gave you my all, boundless and green. You nuzzled my bosom and then ripped her essence. My blood is still pouring all over my pained land. And now I turn away and protect my center. You do not deserve her as you've taken and taken. You did not nurture my nature. And so frost begins. Growth ceases, let the dogged earth stagnate. You do not deserve her as you've taken and taken. You did not nurture my nature. And so death begins. You did not nurture my nature. And so you do not reap. You did not nurture my nature. And so you're diseased. You did not nurture my nature, and so I take back my living self. Yo soy la tierra y todas las flores silvestres. Soy el hielo ártico que se derrite flotando. Soy la tierra que pisas ingratamente. ¿Dónde está tu amor por mí? ¿Dónde está tu agradecimiento? ¿Me extrañarás alguna vez cuando me haya ido? ¿O ahora que te estoy dejando? Mira cómo me tratas, indiferencia modelada. Te di mi todo, ilimitado y verde. Acariciaste mi pecho y luego rasgaste su esencia. Mi sangre aún se derrama por toda mi tierra dolorida. Y ahora me alejo y protejo mi centro. No la mereces, como me has tomado y quitado. No nutriste mi naturaleza, y así comienza la escarcha. El crecimiento cesa, dejará, dejaré que la tierra obstinada se estanque. No la mereces, como me has tomado y quitado. No nutriste mi naturaleza, y así comienza la muerte. No nutriste mi naturaleza, y por eso no cosechas. No cuidaste mi naturaleza y por eso están enfermos. No nutriste mi naturaleza y por eso recupero mi yo en vivo. Thank you, thank you. Thank you so much. That was great. Before we leave, I'm just going to say 
Uh, I just want to say thank you to everybody that's performed tonight. We've had some brilliant songs. We've had some brilliant performances. Thank you to James so much for being uh, behind the, uh, the scenes here with all the techie stuff. And um, thank you to everybody tuning in. Uh, and I'm just going to close now um, with a song, with a song about butterflies because I rear butterflies. And uh, those of you who've heard the song before know that when I say make a butterfly, this is how you make a butterfly. A butterfly like that. And I'm going to put a butterfly in my beard, which is the title of the song. There we are, a butterfly in my beard. And because it's most important, and not only do we save the forests and save the seeds, but we also save the butterflies as well. So here we have a monarch butterfly. And here's the song Butterfly in My Beard. And I had a butterfly in my beard, yeah. I had a butterfly in my beard, oh yeah. I had a butterfly in my beard. It looked pretty strange. It looked pretty weird. I had a butterfly in my beard, oh yeah. They called me the bug man on the news one time. They called me the bug man on the news one time. They called me the bug man on the news. A hissing cockroach on my head got plenty of views. They called me the bug man on the news one time. Now this is the butterfly making verse. So if you could all make butterflies in this verse, it would be absolutely wonderful. So make a butterfly and fly with me, say yeah. And you can say yeah as well, come on, yeah. Make a butterfly and fly with me, say yeah. Yeah, make a butterfly and fly with me. Go anywhere and be really free. Make a butterfly and fly with me, say yeah. Okay, well I can see the butterflies there, and it's looking good. And this is your last chance to make some butterflies, because we're going to close the show as soon as I finish this song. And I want to thank you all again. Thank you so much for making this Ocean Aid concert happen. But here we go. We're going to go out with making butterflies. Come on, make a butterfly and fly with me. Say yeah. Yeah. Oh, make a butterfly and fly with me. Say yeah. Come on, say yeah. Oh, make a butterfly and fly with me. Go anywhere and be really free. Make a butterfly and fly with me. Say yeah. Yeah, yeah, thank you. Thank you, everybody. Thank you for the butterflies. Save the butterflies. Save the forest. Save the seas. Thank you all. Thank you.